Israeli Defense Forces, um, you are the people who I most care about uh, in this whole new war, you know, where a t uh, there was a Hamas attack and Israel is now trying to protect itself. And I've been supportive, but I've, I've changed my position and I want to uh, give you, the people whose lives are on the line, um, the full explanation in a, you know, five minutes. Uh, so forgive me my omissions, um, but why I'm I'm saying um, that I'm, I'm I'm saying I now support a ceasefire. And before I was saying, let's go into Gaza, lock it down, kill Hamas, and 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 yet because your lives are literally on the line, right? Uh, so what changed me? Uh, I'm attaching a video. We all have perhaps, especially Israel, uh, the fear of the hidden hand uh, in world affairs. Let me give you an example, but then I'm going to give you a present example that may even give you pause. Um, there's reason to believe that uh, in the Holocaust, uh, before the formal uh, establishment of the state of Israel after the Holocaust, that uh, rich people, uh, the bankers, the uh, uh, Rockefellers, uh, funded Hitler and, and guided his rise to power in Germany. He was a nobody to some extent. How did he become chancellor of Germany? Hitler, right? Uh, and there's reason to believe that he was funded by people who like war, uh, the bankers, the Illuminati, the 13 families, and, um, and did, little did they care that six million Jews were going to be uh, exterminated in the concentration camps, the hidden hand. Now, I consider myself Jewish. I, I had a personal Holocaust experience uh, with, due to my mother, and I, I, I can't escape the consequences. Um, so I'm with the Israeli people, but I'm not with Benjamin Netanyahu uh, in the following respect, now get ready because it's going to really shock you. It may make you angry, but uh, I'm including a video from an acquaintance of mine who says that uh, Israelis uh, were involved, not the uh, Arabs, uh, in the U.S. attack of 9-11-2001. So I'll include two videos, one disproving that it was the Arabs, and the other, it's only 19 minutes, and the other one making the case, and you can an, analyze it and see what you think, because I'm sure you'd love to hear back from you, uh, saying that, and, and, and I want to emphasize to you, and I, I know this may sound ridiculous what I'm about to say, but I have to give you the whole picture. I believe that the Illuminati uh, are half, actually half extraterrestrial. I, I'm, I'm, uh, I, I'm with David Icke, the famous conspiracy theorist, conspiracy realist. Uh, they even come from constellation Draco near the North Star, and they are the Satans of the Milky Way. That's a simplified version. Even David Icke uh, has a hidden agenda, but it's it's, make, it's the most easily understandable. So uh, I don't blame Israel for, whatever, even, if, even if you watch this video that I'm attaching and say, oh my God, uh, we have dirty hands, uh, Rip Holmes uh, is right to say, let's do a ceasefire. Let's get this whole thing sorted out. Um, I, I'm not actually, the poor J Jewish faith, of which I consider myself a member, I'm not formally, uh, you know, inducted. I haven't, I, I'm not a member. I'm not a full-fledged Jew, but I am in my heart. So uh, there's only 16 million Jews in the world. Jews, uh, Israel, they have good reason to fear genocide because as an example, and or you, you, I'm telling you things you already know, but I just want to show you I'm on the right side. There's 450 million Arabs. Why are the Arabs killing Jews? Uh, do, you, do you follow me? It does, it's really, really appalling. It's just, a, it's, it's a, so, but I want you to know where my heart is. The thing is that if it's true that uh, Israel was manipulated into triggering the 9-11 wars against Iraq and Afghanistan, then who's to say that uh, the hidden hand, the Illuminati, are not trying to trigger World War III?
Uh, I don't know if that's been intelligible. I told you I try to get this done in five minutes. It's just over. So I'll just summarize. My perception is the people behind most of the, all of the big wars, the Illuminati, the hidden hand, did World War II. They uh, gave, even the Rothschild family, uh, uh, funded Hitler to get him in power to lead to the, the Holocaust loss, killing of six million Jews. Uh, and they're up to new games at, with 9-11. They, the Jews did not want to be on the wrong side of the Illuminati. They may have been basically uh, put under duress to help the 9-11 attack. I don't blame them, but I personally, I think that this did happen. And there was a, an Israeli, but it goes up to Netanyahu, because you and I know that the Israelis get the shaft all the time, right? American Jews basically are constantly getting the shaft, right? Uh, so I'm not talking about regular people, and I'm not talking about people in the Israeli Defense Force. I'm talking about Netanyahu. Um, so that's why I'm causing, ca calling, excuse me, that's why I'm changing my position and calling for a ceasefire, because who's to say that what's going on with this Hamas attack and Netanyahu still in power that this isn't, if if there was a hidden Israel role in 9-11 leading to f f false wars in Iraq and Afghanistan, who's to say this isn't a replay except of the bigger stake of World War III? And I think it has to be sorted out before we are all pawns in that. I'm not saying that Israel uh, should turn the other cheek to this Hamas attack. I'm not saying that. Uh, these are innocent people who were killed. But I, I think before we plunge into a possible World War III, we've got to sort things out.